Hello everyone, my name is Rhonda and I'll be talking about how to pick things up safely. So without further ado, let's come to our lovely wall here. So the basics is you want to make sure that you bend your knees and that you are not applying any pressure onto your back. Okay, so I'll show you in front of you first. So you want to make sure that your feet are shoulder width apart. So how you can firstly get that done is your feet will be together, you'll bring your feet outwards, and then your heels follow. Okay, so that's how you know that your feet are shoulder width apart. Okay, and then once you get comfortable with finding out where your measurements are, that's when you can just naturally get into that position. Okay, so from here, you're gonna start off by hinging your hip back. So you will tilt your hip backwards, but your back will stay straight. And then from there, you'll bend those knees. Back still staying straight. You go, go down and down and down. And then you pick that up, okay? And then when you come up, it will be a nice and smooth motion. So from this side, okay, exactly the same thing. So you're gonna hinge through your back. Okay, hinge through your hips, sorry. And then from here, back still staying straight, okay? You will then, Bend the knees and then continue to go down and then that's when you can pick that up and then you push through your feet. Okay, so nice hip hinge sort of motion. Okay, you can also hold on to things as well. So for example, I'll show you. So same thing for when you're holding on to something, you'll hinge through your hip, holding, um, holding on to your rail or something like that, or like a high chair, make sure that it's sturdy, and then you'll just pick something like that as well. So that will make it, that will make it quite easy for you, especially when you're starting off. So yeah, that is how you're able to pick something up safely.